what's up you guys tomorrow welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are well so in today's video i want to give you guys a closet and bedroom like our drawers just the clutter and organization video i'm gonna bring that to you guys and it came about because our closet fell y'all the weirdest thing just out the blue all the closet racks fell and so we were just left with clothes on the floor and this is how we had to live for a little while so it started because just one day i went to use our restroom in our bedroom and noticed that my side of the closet had fallen so this is what you can see right now all the racks and stuff this is um when it was getting ready to be prepared and so we just went ahead and took down my husband's racks as well um just so they can um be repaired and then it can all just be new together so that's just kind of where this started i knew i needed to declutter but this just kind of pushed me to do it so i'm gonna take you guys through our process of going through all these clothes that we had hanging up and also getting our drawers organized because it has been a while since i've done it and i want to say it maybe was a year or so ago when I decluttered and that video is actually on my channel if you want to go take a look at it but I'm going to get through all of this and I hope it motivates you guys if you've got that closet that you need to get in and declutter and get some of that stuff out of there that you know you don't wear you just pulling a rack um going to the next item and you're passing over so many things or maybe you lost weight or maybe you gained weight or maybe it's just not your style anymore but i know we tend to just hang on to things so i hope this motivates you guys to just get rid of that stuff so let's go through this process So when the closet fell, we just kind of took everything out, especially when it was going to be repaired. And these are all the clothes that were on the shelf, like I mentioned before. Um, and then just some other random stuff and other items that may have been washed or whatever. And they were kind of folded down here. But as we had to um, live through this, we have to look for clothes throughout these piles so they just kind of got messed up so now that we're getting ready to put everything back in there i'm just going to go through the clothes refold them like i said some of these are random like dish towels and stuff like that put those in their area and then we can go through and start decluttering and refolding these these items that go back on the shelves if you hear the washer going so i picked up all the clothes that were folded that are usually on our middle rack and i'll show you the closet in a minute and i've got those on the bed some of those i just quickly went through to see which ones i wanted to give away and i wait on my husband to figure out what he wants to give away so right now i've started going through my things that are on the floor going through them as i pick them up and um basically seeing if i would ever wear it again some things are like in a maybe and i'll just come back around to it so i put the ones that i'm sure about over in the stack and then the ones that i am you know on the fence about and then i will put those in the stack so then once i'm done i can go back through all the maybes and see i'm just trying not to have all this stuff in there anymore um a lot of this stuff you know i hadn't worn in a while um and a lot of the bulk of it is my clothes for work. I work at a corporate office, so I'm having to dress professionally. And that's just not my normal day-to-day -day attire. So um, that's where the bulk of the hanging stuff is. And then um, 
I just want to make it just a little bit easier to find, not cluttered up. No, Bella. Um, not cluttered up and then um, I will wait till Bay is ready to go through his things. This will be a process because while I'm doing the closet, I also want to do the drawers as well. So even if I don't finish it today, I do want to at least get these things up off the floor. So by the time you guys finish this video, it'll be me going through everything. So I just wanted to kind of let you know what my thought process was with some of this stuff. And um, I'm just gonna continue to go through all the stuff that's on the floor. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I was so frustrated around this time when this happened. If you follow me and my family on our family vlog channel, it's always linked below if you're interested, but I expressed how I felt about it, y'all. I, I know it may not mean a lot to some people or may not be a big situation, but to just come in the room all of a sudden and your closet is on the floor, y'all. Then I had to live through all of this every day every night it's like i couldn't sleep because the clutter and stuff was everywhere so it was not a fun experience but i'm so happy that we got new racks and everything and we've decluttered stuff you know what i mean so we can just get it back organized because that was just not a good time for me okay so right now i'm just gonna go ahead and just vacuum up all the dust and stuff like that from when it was being repaired so that i can get ready and get some of this stuff back in the closet So I don't change out my clothes from seasons. Nobody does in our household. Not saying that our closets are huge, they could be bigger, but I don't have time for that or have a lot of clothes, you know? So I just kind of mix everything in. And also mentioning again where I work, I can wear long sleeves because it's so cold sometimes in the summertime or I'm wearing cardigans because I have a tattoo on my arm. You know what I'm saying? So things like that. So I'm always just like mixing and mingling my clothes, but only thing I try to do is kind of like put colors together so it could be long sleeves uh, coral with short sleeve tops or I'll put all my cut off tops together and just color code those but nothing too serious um, I just mm -mm, I can't keep up with all of that so do you guys change your clothes out from season to season and then also do you guys color code or do you you know put you know certain textures together or what all do you hang up i really just hang up my pants dresses and my um blouses and cardigans and stuff like that um but i know some people try to hang up as much as they can i believe if i had a bigger closet then i probably would so leave it down below in the comment section how you guys organize your closet I saw you, I knew all the time 
It was something in the air that night And in the way you looked at me I get nervous when you get close And my heart fills up with butterflies And then you leave me speechless My world turned upside down That you won't go and break my heart Break my heart, don't break it now Remember it's the only one I've got The one I've got Don't break my heart Don't break my heart You would think that it's me who have a hard time getting rid of items. It's my husband. That's why I was over there like helping him my bag. I hadn't seen you in this in years. And then his thing is, but what if I get rid of it and then I want it one day? I want to wear it one day. I'm like, man, you'll be to buy something else. So he's a little bit harder with getting rid of stuff. He did get rid of a nice amount of things. But um, he could have definitely gotten rid of more. And I probably could have too, but... Not as much as him. So this is my pal, just mine, of things that I am getting rid of. My husband had already taken his down, so I'm just going to bag mine up so that he can take mine downstairs as well. I feel like I did pretty good. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments. So y'all, here are the exciting afters of the bedroom because it was a hot mess of the drawers and most importantly, the closet with everything back in it, y'all. So this was so satisfying. It was a lot of work before the satisfaction, but it was so satisfying and just having everything folded correctly where I can get to it and being able to get into the closet because even before it fell down, y'all, it was bad, okay? I just didn't get to show y'all before a pick, okay? But... I mean, everything is just so organized. It has a place. We no longer have to just pull through and go through clothes that we don't wear. Um, and it's just made life a whole lot easier. And I have been able to sleep better. 
okay so these are the drawers i fold them all up both of ours i'm showing you my husband's side right here he's been excited about it as well because he can just go in and grab you know what he needs and it's just made getting ready a whole lot easier okay um it takes a little bit more time with folding to get these in you know in this way to get them back in the drawer but it's all worth it so this drawer is just some of my leggings and this is my husband's drawer um and the rest of these are his like his a shirts and basketball shorts and stuff like that so everything has a place and it's definitely just made things a whole lot easier for us y'all look at my closet I know to some it's like it's still packed up in there and yeah it is so imagine what it looked like at first but um this is my husband size so I just kind of organized it by his casual like cotton shirts his polo style shirts long sleeve cotton shirts button down shirts sweaters slacks and then he has his tennis shoes up top and then he has a rack at the bottom as well and um it's just easy y'all so over here in the middle rack just has his hats and my hats at the bottom, my sweatpants, my uh, shorts and my jeans. It's like Nike, Adidas, like sport t-shirts, his shorts and his jeans and khakis up top. Then we have like my purses and um, some boots that I should have gotten rid of because I don't think I'm wearing. But anyway, then I just have my little rainbow of clothes um in no particular uh, order other than color and maybe long sleeves towards the back and then my shoes at the bottom and this is it y'all so it feels so good to have this stuff organized so if you have not made it to this area and you know it's been calling your name go ahead and do it this took it, we didn't do it in one day it took some days okay but we got it done so i'm challenging you to pick a place that you can declutter and i promise you you'll sleep better at night okay so thank y'all so much for hanging out with me today i hope that you leave this video motivated y'all so thank you again don't forget to leave me a thumbs up it really helps my channel subscribe if you have not i would love to have you over here and i'll see you in my next video bye y'all your time devotion